Global Agenda for Sustainable Livestock, or GASL, as you'll hear us refer to. I'm Assistant Director General at the International Livestock Research Institute, ILRI, in Kenya. I'll make a few brief remarks about GASL and about today's regional consultation to put it in a wider context. The Global Agenda for Sustainable Livestock is a unique multi-stakeholder partnership that brings together all typologies of livestock stakeholders, smallholders to commercial and everything in between, and different organizations, NGOs, governments, academia, private, public sector, civil society, and multilateral organizations. Through this rather unique adding together role, GASL works to assemble evidence to foster dialogue and consensus around the livestock related issues and to support, support practice and policy change towards sustainable livestock solutions that contribute to development ambitions as expressed in the GASL vision, which says by 2030, sustainable, inclusive, resilient, and diverse livestock systems across the world contribute significantly to the sustainable development goals of the UN Agenda 2030 and are integral to sustainable food systems. So today's meeting is one of eight regional consultations that are taking place across the world in these couple of months before we have a global meeting, a multi-stakeholder meeting of the Global Agenda for Sustainable Livestock, which is scheduled to take place the 30th of October to the 3rd of November in Chiang Mai, Thailand. And that will focus on multi-stakeholder collaboration to strengthen sustainability and resilience of livestock systems in response to drivers of change. Regional meetings such as this provide an opportunity for you as participants to consider some of the major drivers of change that are, and are still in many cases, impacting the world as a whole and what these mean for all aspects of livestock in this particular region. Some major drivers of change that impact on livestock systems and sustainability have been identified as environmental and technological drivers, health and disease drivers, geopolitical and socio-economic drivers. Each of these drivers is being further unpacked in a series of online webinars uh, that are taking place in early September and have been jointly organized by GASL along with CATIA, the Tropical Research and Higher Education Center in Costa Rica. I'd encourage you to listen into those and I believe that you'll receive details on how you can do that during today's consultation. Today's regional consultation thus allows exploration of the actual and potential impacts of such drivers in relation to four sustainability domains that really frame the ambitions of the Global Agenda for Sustainable Lifestyle. <coughs> These domains are food and nutrition security, livelihood